hello everyone welcome back in this video we are going to see the different vm sizes so here we can see you know a series which is entry level vms for dev and test environment and here you can see you know the cost for this a series which is per month and next you can see b series which is economical bustable vms which is you know suitable for workloads which are low traffic web server small databases and so on and you can also see the cost for per month for the b series and next d series which is a general purpose compute and here you know we can see that uh, the e-commerce system and web front end so we can see based on the workloads and the requirement you can choose the series and uh, then e series which is optimized for in memory applications and you can see that uh, it cost around 58 dot euro per month and this is you know workloads that's suitable for sap hana and uh, you can see the workloads we can use for this series. So if I go to the uh, Azure portal and let's try to create the virtual machine, here I can you know show you the list of uh, available sizes. So here, if you click on see all sizes, here uh, based on the requirement, we can choose the VM size. For example, if I want to, you know, how minimum 2 vCPU and 16 gig RAM, and uh, I need to choose this, you know, uh, type. Here it will also produce the 8 gig of uh, data disk and the maximum IOPS and the temporary storage. And uh, if I just need only one vCPU with 8 gig RAM, then I can choose this type. So uh, in case uh, if you want to go for a higher you know, memory and vCPU, then you can choose the different types. So just an example, I'm just selecting and select, then I can you know, deploy the VM with this size. And you can see F series, G series, so i will provide the link in the description so that you can just uh, you know look at the available you know the types and the series for the virtual machines so that's it in this video and i'll see you in the next thank you